Hello, welcome back to Barony. Oh, what is this? Faded copy of my journal. Nah. What is this? Gates are barred shut from the other side. There's a story in this game. Uh, it's, uh, I don't know. I wouldn't say it's generic, but definitely it's not the reason to play. Um, you know, town was ruled by a bad baron and he exploited the townsfolk and then, you know, they trapped them in the mine and then suddenly they were attacked by monsters. So, uh, chances are pretty good. The baron is like setting a whole bunch of monsters on Did that rat just like break through that door. That's pretty good. Wow. Apparently rats can just like break through doors. That was pretty good. I, I got uh, I hit them at exactly the peak of our uh, ooh, fresh, fresh fish. The peak of our of our hit of our mace smack. Good to look up, um, you know, for potential traps. The traps that hit you from above are the ones that are mo most likely going to hit you or uh, sorry, kill you. There's our exit. Oh God. Rat. Rat. Okay, we're almost level two. I don't know if maybe there's like a, like recommendation of, uh, you know, get to level two or three in the first floor and then you're good. You know, like how much uh, should you be progressing on each floor before moving on? Definitely, I think the more you push into a dungeon, the more you are extending your resources. It's a risk reward kind of thing, of course. But, you know, the more we collect, the more we are raising our appraise, the more we are leveling up. Uh, potentially, I hope that, um, you know, the more we level up, the more damage we're going to be doing and the more survivability we will have oh good a pie oh goody i hope that pie is not cursed that would be most foul okay well well look at all this stuff we got we're getting all kinds of stuff good stuff maybe hopefully Hopefully good stuff. Who knows? Oh, well, our praise is leveling up. That's the important thing. I think. I don't know. Maybe. Uh, okay. We're just about done. I mean, there's a couple of places we could check out, but at this point, it's like, how much are you going to be wearing on your hunger by fully exploring the dungeon? What's over here? Uh, uh-oh. Batty. Wah! Critically hit the skeleton. Uh. There we go. Okay, let's uh, drop some cursed things. That and that. Uh, and that, apparently. Can I... Oh, we have a helmet. And we have boots. Yay, boots. And we have a Grant's Water Breathing uh, Amulet that is not cursed. And we have Excellent Magistaff of Locking. Uh, interesting. Kind of want to try it, if only to, uh, you know, improve our magic casting. We have a Worn Iron Spear. I don't know if we should be, like, keeping stuff like that. Like, should we be keeping weapons that we're not going to use? I, I feel like the answer is no. If it's money we want, we'll get money. Ooh, a, a lantern. Oh, that seems like a really good get. That kind of makes everything worthwhile here. Our mace uh, skill has upgraded. Oh, an aged tin. I hope it's tuna. Oh, I just realized walking to the edge end of that hallway was probably not good idea
Wow. Lots of things to explore with not really any... Anything interesting or compelling at the end of... What's that? Crack gem? Ring? A big loop? We are pretty close to level 3. We could find one more thing to kill. That wouldn't be a bad thing. Ooh. Surfaceable sl slingshot. Yay. Hurrah. Uh. Ugh. We can break this door. It, it would take a while, though. But, like, is there anything inside? Is this worth it at all? Probably not. That's a big no. If uh, if we could have made that loop around, that, that would have made it worth it. Because then I wouldn't have to travel so far to get back to uh, the exit. Right, I'm going to be taking torches. I wonder if I can cook food. Pull torch. You pull a torch from the fire. You pull a torch from the fire. Okay, so you can pull a bunch of torches from the fire. Good to know. Nothing down there. Let's see dungeon pretty much fully explored. There's a little bit left, but I don't think it's worth it. But am I going to do it? I guess so. Take torch. Yeah, sure. We've got a lot of torches now. If that lantern's not cursed, then we can drop all of them. Ah. Uh, wait, what? A lantern also burns out? Why? That sucks. What's the point? Something died down here. Wonder why. Wonder what killed them. Ooh, a score roll. Okay, well that's gonna do it for floor one. Yeah, and we are hungry. What do you mean next interaction? Oh, I see pickup item. Okay, let's leave and then let's see if, oh God, no, not the Minotaur. Oh God. Uh, if you know what that the Minotaur is, then you know how awful it is. Are you a friend? Nice. Uh, I, I have to find an exit right away. I'm just going to be ignoring everything for the most part. Oh, God. Ouch. Ouch. Leadership increase. Um, so if you don't know about the Minotaur, it's basically like the ghost in Spelunky. Only far worse, in my opinion. Uh, let's get rid of that. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. These are just for the purposes of raising our praise and nothing else. Uh, yeah, the Minotaur is a big scary monster and it will basically stomp you like you are nothing. And if you do not leave quickly enough, then you will be beset by a horrible, horrible time. Yay, we got a another follower. I sure hope none of these these are these guys won't all die. You can uh, pull that lever multiple times in order to. Uh, you know, make the trap set and potentially kill those spiders without having to fight them directly. So what do we got going on here? Pretty sure uh, this is... I, I seem to recall this uh, is like to a troll. No trespassing. Pretty sure... Oh, God. Oh, no. One of our friends died. Oh god, there it is. Ha! 
Yeah. If I wasn't like super over uh, uh, over encumbered. Wow, they might actually kill the Minotaur. Holy shit. They killed the Minotaur. Did they also die? Would have been legit if they could res me. Okay, restart. Yeah, Minotaur sucks. I really did not have a lot of time to mess around with that level. Because I would, uh, exactly that would happen. Minotaur is the worst. It's funny too, cause like the Minotaur almost always shows up on the second floor. I'm gonna try and I'm gonna take less torches. I I, I think eight is a good number for now. I don't regret picking up like basically. Oh, I was gonna try and get the landing the the killing blow on that rat. Steal that XP. I don't know if that even works, but, uh, you know, don't I have, um, what are these scrolls summon? Yeah. I, as a cleric, I can summon a couple creatures. That's like old school clerics. Clerics were not just always the Healy class. They were also the summoning class, you know, them and wizards, of course, but you know, them as well. Uh, summoning is always pretty good. I should, uh, if I make it to the next floor, I'll summon something. I guess this will just like make this a round trip. So I don't have to go, uh, out of my way to fully exp you know. Oh, this guy's got an arrow. Oh, an arrow. Ouch. Okay, let's, uh, get our shield out. There we go. Easy peasy. Get get your get your actual shield out and you know do some work. I wonder if like attacking wears on our strength as well. Uh, well, this was pointless. We have some cursed items. We have a helmet we can use. I would, I, I would, oh, this mace is not worth it. Blessed, it is blessed. Serviceable, worn. But so is our current mace, so not really any point. Hey. Uh, how do we... Okay, we're going to put this on our hotbar. We have a short bow. It's a good get. Really good get. Doing a little bit of damage before you, um, you know, start fighting melee is not a bad thing at all. Of course, if you take damage then it kind of negates the positive effects of using a bow. Oh God. Ah, no, no. Stop it. She's so close to death. She's so close to death. It's it's not even funny. Yes. All right. If you don't know what happened just there, if you drink from a fountain, there's a chance it'll spawn a succubus. And they are kind of a problem. It's torn spellbook of locking, faded spellbook. We're identifying one spellbook. Teaches light. Now we're talking. Oh heck yeah, bud. Let's uh let's give that a go. Oh, you just learn it. Huh. 
Okay, I, I have a little a thing to learn here and there about how spell casting works. So if I do B, can I put this on a on my oh it is already on my cool bar. Prepared spell light. Oh so it's prepared. So now in theory if I press F Heck yeah, bud. Does it follow me? Yeah, that would mean that I don't have to carry a torch anymore. It's not ideal, as I recall, it's not great, but it's better than torches. Yeah, this game's got like all of the depth that one would want or hope hope for in a traditional roguelike, but in first person. I, I'm sure that for some the graphics would be a turn off, but I, I would say check again friend because they're pretty good I think they they look real good actually uh, Okay, we got rats ratos Oh I love the way the the that rat like just kind of ragdolled somewhat not the true definition of ragdoll, of course, but like, you know. How it flew up in the air when I smacked it with the mace. That was fun. So I'm not going to drop my torches. I might still need them, especially if I get a, another spell that I want to use. Our praise has leveled up. <laughs> okay. Just want to like cross our I's and dot our T's a little bit. Marked spellbook. Nice. New spellbook. Definitely getting some spellbooks in the early game that you can actually appraise is uh, not a bad thing at all. I would think that like getting locking. I think that's my second book of locking now. Learnable. Let's read it. We've learned locking. Uh, it's not a terrible. Oh, wait a minute. Force bowl. Oh, there we go. That's what you want. That is what you want. Um, force bowl is a decent spell. So now, yeah, uh, we're back to torches. Although it seems like the the light lasts a long time. It lasts a long time. Ow! That was not great. Oh, we have a Jester's uh, hat over there. Okay. You have to uh, excuse my rushing in, but you know what? Let's uh, cast a locking spell on this. Why not? Just to just to give ourselves some safety for a moment. I sure hope it's not locked to us. Uh, HP restore. We could drink this. Now we're we are boozed up a little bit. We got some fresh meat. What is this? Why is this? Oh, broken. I see. Okay. Do I have new helmet? Uh, faded spellbook of locking. Locking. We could drop spellbooks that we've already learned from. I'm sure any second now we are going to. I guess we're already hungry. I don't know. Let's eat some food. That. Meat hit the spot. Nice. I feel sober again. That's good too. There's also these uh, scrolls I should probably. Oh, blessed. Hmm. I should. Uh, I'll summon a creature. How about that? Disappears. You summon a friendly ghoul. Where? Oh, hello, ghoul. Command ghoul. Uh, wait here. Missing skills. Stat requirements. I don't know if they're gonna follow me. I guess they will. 
Oh, it's, it's locked. I guess uh, you can't open the door. Okay, let's uh, prepare force bolt. Yay. Oh God. Uh, what just happened? Well, my leadership increased. Good things are happening right now, even though it, it doesn't seem that way. Let's pick up stuff to uh, appraise them. Jester hat. I really want to wear the jester hat. We might have a someone we can sell to. <laughs> the way the rat flies away is really funny to me. Hello, friend. Trade with Peter. Um, can we sell stuff? We can sell cursed items, apparently. I do not trade in that. Oh, I see. You trade in jewelry, which is the only thing that you won't. Appraisal is not high enough to identify a flawless gem. Uh, well, apparently he'll only buy them for a gold each. So that kind of sucks. And all of his stuff is super expensive. So we could buy a flawless amulet. So let's buy that. Uh, we have to appraise it ourselves of strangulation really well does this just kill me i i don't want to wear that uh that does not sound good to me like if i could use it to strangle other people or creatures that'd be kind of cool but as it stands it kind of sounds like not good there's a ring some money i am trying to use spells in order to increase my ability to use spells Excellent magic staff. Serviceable bronze mace. Identified a serviceable bronze mace. Okay. Well, that's good. Let's get rid of it now. Ah, this worn jester's hat sucks. What do you mean, cursed? Is that the shield I'm using? Sure hope not. Get rid of this stuff. Lock stores and chests. Really? Game loves the lock spell. Oh, excellent magic staff of light. Well, that's nice. We don't have to use it uh, as a spell anymore. Kind of want to not use the bow anymore. Since uh, I've got, you know, Force bolt. I'd rather be a good mage than a good archer. I'm sure there's good reasons to be both. I mean, for one thing, um, improving multiple skills would mean we would level up faster. Lost journal. I mean, is it? Yeah, it's unidentified. Worth worth taking if only to identify it. Uh-oh. Almost uh, got away with not, like, taking any damage there. Uh, I'm gonna get rid of this magic staff. I, I'm feeling the, uh, I'm, I'm feeling the, the, the squeeze in terms of, like, our inventory space. 
Poison resistance. Now, there we go. That's a decent uh, amulet. Get rid of this. Get rid of that. Take that. <gasps> oh, God. Pretty sure trolls will only attack you if you invade their space. Uh oh. Is that the only way out now? Yeah. Yeah. I, I fell for the old, uh, door behind you is closed and the only way out is through the troll uh, troll way the old troll troll all right well i did better um i guess maybe i would have done even better if i just like when i realized i had to attack the troll just like uh summon my other two ghouls that would have been a little bit better i don't know well, uh, let me know how I'm doing in the comments and uh, maybe I can improve. Uh, if you're enjoying this series, definitely hit that like button and consider subscribing for more content like this. I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy.